All right, everyone, just want to wish you a happy and safe Memorial Day if you're in the U.S. We're grateful for the freedoms that we have, that we have left at least. So I want to give you all a quick update here on uh, the DT-50. So what I've done is I've uh, spent a considerable amount of time laying these graphics down. I think I got them about right. They're definitely uh, quite challenging to line up just because of the angles and some you know weird lines and gyrations of the tank so to speak but right now what i've done is if you remember the last video the tank was super shiny i basically took some 1500 grit and i wet sanded it so the next step is going to be once i get the 2k clears to go over it but what i wanted to do was make sure there was no imperfections and also we had really good adhesion so that's where the 1500 wet sanding came into play of course, we lost a little shine, but that's what the 2K is going to put back. So I just want to show you all what it's looking like. I think they look pretty good. Um, I did a slight bit of trimming on that yellow stripe, as I said, because of the fact that it was a little bit longer than uh, the OEM, and I had measurements. And I could also see that uh, the yellow actually stops pretty much right where this bend is. So that got everything lined up right. The other side is kind of the same, but also a little difficult because you've got a um, just a smaller space and just another weird angle because you've got your radiator right there. Uh, the tank definitely has some interesting positions. But yeah, I think these look really good. So we'll just be waiting for the next part of it, which is the clear, and then we'll go over the tank with that. I think it's gonna really come together pretty nice. So yeah, let me know what you think and um, I think it's coming together. God bless America and happy Memorial Day.